Hi, Mario here. Before I start, I want to thank my patrons for supporting my work. Today I want to tell you something more about Chitsen Itza. Chitsen Itza is one of the largest ancient sites in the Americas with about 46 monuments on it, from small to large. We measured all 46 monuments on the orientation. You see here the list of measurements. Curious is that all monuments on Chichen Itza are clockwise oriented. And the odds are surprisingly low that this pattern can occur just by chance. The orientation pattern on Chichen Itza seems to be chaotic, but that appears not to be true. The orientations are between 0 and plus 27 degrees. There are many theories devised about the Pyramid of Kukulkan that a snake descends during the summer solstice. But no one ever wondered why this pyramid is oriented the way it is. And why there are two similar oriented smaller pyramids inside because the superstitious religious offspring of the original builders renovated the pyramid many thousands of years later, leaving the original orientation of the foundation intact. But how old is Chitsen Itza really? If you know about a theory, you know about the five poles, the poles one to five. Pole one is our current geographic pole. It's not the magnetic pole, it is the pole around which the Earth spins, called the geographic pole or the spin axis. We also discovered four other geographic poles, pole 2, pole 3, pole 4 and pole 5. We have an approximate location of pole 6. The ages and the positions of the poles 1 to 5 are proven. Pole 1 is the easiest pole to find because it is our current geographic pole. Ancient monuments like the Pyramids of Giza are oriented to our current pole 1. To prove the other pole positions we have collected a massive database of virtually all ancient monuments around the world and their orientation patterns have guided us to these five Pole positions. Well, it appears that the monuments on Chichen Itza are overwhelmingly oriented to the pole 1 to 4. 37 of the 46 monuments, I repeat, 37 of the 46 monuments on Chichen Itza are oriented to these relative small areas of the ancient poles. And to prove that we are right in our claims, we have built a special simulation tool that uses an advanced simulation technique called Monte Carlo simulations. The image you see here shows 10,000 simulations. One dot represents one simulation and we ran multiple of these simulations after another. You see here how rare it is that 31 of the 46 monuments can coincidentally match the pole positions. That occurs only one to two times every 10,000 simulations. The chances that 32 monuments coincidentally can match the pole positions are even more rare. Imagine how slim the odds are that 37 monuments can coincidentally match the pole positions. What does this prove? It proves that the orientations on Chichen Itza are no accident. Their orientations follow the poles 4 up to 1 with a probability of almost 100%. I must say that Chichen Itza's monuments might have been renovated many times upon the much older foundations 
and so they might appear not so very old. But the fact is that the original orientation of the foundations reveals their actual true age. You see here a series of simulations and notice how impossible it is for 37 orientation to occur by accident. This is the ultimate proof that the first building activity on Chitsen Itza started around 270,000 years ago. Chitsen Itza follows the movement of the migrating geographic pole that is ultimately caused by expansion of the Earth. The crust of the Earth rewraps itself every time after an expansion cycle. And this caused the spin axis relative to the crust to change. You can find more of our work on Patreon. You can follow us and support our work on Patreon. If you subscribe to the tier Unlock Secret Content or higher, you receive a password to unlock articles on our website, which is only for members. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.